By the second week of our biking adventure, we were physically and mentally drained. But thankfully, this all improved with time. Let <laughs> us consult the oracle. Oh yeah, we're here. Which is just the halfway up this little climb. And we're gonna break for lunch there before our quads go on fire for the rest of the day going up the hill. We're gonna get up to 800 meters today, hopefully. The very peak. We thought the steep climb would be our biggest challenge of the day until we saw this teeny tiny bridge. Go for it. Yeah. You're gonna ride it. I'll fall in if I ride that. We reached the center. Center of the North Island. Don't even have the energy to get off my bike. <laughs> Where's the bath on? At this point, we were very slowly making our way towards the timber trail. This is the trail. Let's start. Finish. This trail quickly became our favorite. 85 kilometers of single track through dense forest. Ah! Best track so far. <laughs> Look at the steering wheel. <laughs> George, hang up. We've just passed 10, so we've got like. 10 and a half? Yeah, 15, yeah. Ten and a half, and we're at the highest point of the entire ride. Sweet! <laughs> Yoo-hoo! The climb to the summit was exhausting, but we were looking forward to the downhill section yum, yum. ahead of us. We then spent the night at Camp Epic, which is situated about halfway through the track. Luckily for us, New Zealand has an abundance of water oh, so good. to drink and to use oh. for cooking. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah. Look at the old timber holding it up. We were fortunate enough to cross paths with Linley and Co. The timber trail would not be maintained without these heroes volunteering their own time, so thank you. It soon began to pour with rain, and some were loving it more than others. I'm going to put this away with it's getting wet. Bring up, put them away. So good. My bike is so clean.
were going to go on a canoe trip and then it got cancelled because of the rain and then we managed to get a lift for 50 k's. Thanks Willie. Thanks Willie. <laughs> But it wasn't all smooth sailing as a number of trees had fallen onto the roads. We're down near the Fanganui River, which is uh, overflowing at the moment, and we're cycling to our next spot. So we're basically cycling along like the edge of a mountain. And uh, there's been heaps of uh, landslides. Would you call them landslides? Mudslides? Slidey stuff of land. This is probably the most amazing section of the ride so far. Look at that. We eventually made it to Wanganui, where we caught a different kind of lift. So cool! Now at the top here, um, we do have some great views, and you can find the 41 stairs. Us two geniuses thought it was a good idea to leave Wanganui um, in the middle of the day on a 25 degree day with I don't know what the humidity would be. That sounds cold but it was it was up there. We were running low on water so we pulled into this um, farm that we're on now and asked for a water top up. Lady who lives here very very kindly offered us to camp up on the front the front garden, the front paddock. Her husband just brought us down a little fireplace and some chairs and a cold beer. Unreal. Simple okay. everyday items Sorry. such as chairs Fucking become good. luxury when you're traveling by bike. We've been blown away by the generosity of the local people and we are very grateful to everyone who helped us out along the way. Mmm, porridge for a change. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. I love it. Where are we off to? Uh, today we are climbing the Rimitakis summit, which is pretty much that right there. That a little bit further down. So um, we've got a pretty steep climb today. This is probably the most impressive tunnel yet. <sighs> oh, sick. Look at that. <sighs> it's like waterfalls on either side. So we just scaled the summit of the last, the last mountain on the North Island. And we had a couple beers in the bag, but they, they, um, they went warm, so we're chilling them in the creek. <laughs> what day is it? It's fairy day! <laughs> 
first time we've seen the sea since Kawakawa. Yeah. Like 800 kilometers ago. <clears throat> 800. Almost there. Just following the highway. Not the nicest. And then the ferry's off there. <laughs> By the time we had reached the ferry, we had cycled almost a thousand kilometres and were ready for chapter two in the South Island.